Environment and Public Works Committee on a bipartisan vote of 12 to 8. Yesterday, I, I received a letter, an interesting letter, from a bipartisan group of four former EPA general counsels representing the Trump administration, the Obama administration, the administration of George W. Bush, and, and Bill Clinton. They uh, were uh, basically conveying the same message. They support the confirmation of Jeff Prieto to serve as the general counsel of the Environmental Protection Agency. Like you say, that doesn't happen every day. We get letters of support from, from nominees, different parties, different, different agencies from time to time. But to have four former EPA general counsels from two Republican administrations of late and two Democratic administrations, all in support of the nomination of Jeff Prieto to serve in this important role, uh, that got my attention. And I hope it gets the attention of all of our colleagues. Uh, they, uh, those who wrote to us, the four who wrote to us, very correctly point out uh, that Mr. Prieto is, and I, I quote, this is their words, not mine, uniquely qualified for the position of general counsel for EPA. So they go on to say, Mr. Prieto has been a long-standing champion of human health and environmental protection for all Americans. The letter continues, quote, he is fair, he is just, he's ethical. He will make decisions strictly based on facts, science, and the law. We expect, we expect he will be ready to serve on day one. Madam President, there's no order. Madam President, there's no order in the Senate. The Senate will come to order. Not surprisingly, I completely agree with their sentiments. Having come to know Mr. Prieto following his nomination by President Biden, I believe he will be an outstanding EPA general counsel. He comes from a patriotic Latino family with a proud history of military service. He has the intellect, the temperament, and experience to serve in this important role. Six years ago, this body saw fit to confirm Jeff Prieto unanimously for the very same position, general counsel, at the Department of Agriculture. We should confirm him again today for this post. He was the right choice then, he's the right choice now, and I encourage our colleagues to join me in supporting his nomination. With that, Madam President, I yield back. Thank you. Unanimous 